welcome you all to math bridges fun with math it's a math integrated activity based on whirly art in this video we will identify the kinds of angles which are present in the whirly art whirly art it's a traditional art form of maharashtra these paintings are mainly dominated by using the basic geometric shapes like lines circles triangles and squares let's see how to draw these shapes first before we identify the angles i want you people to know how to draw these shapes i'll show you a step by step process over here take a pencil on the scale draw a slanting line like this step 1 next one more line make it like x now you draw a horizontal line up and one more down like this now to this one vertical line above next step a circle it will become a face for the body here the two triangles congruent triangles over here and the next one now we will give the hands one line again one more here what we'll do we'll give one small dot so that it looks like a hand fingers now the next part one more hand in the same manner we are doing now the same thing now we will go on to the legs you observe here for hands and legs in the last we are giving a small point over here small dot now this is a man if you want to draw a woman what we have to do just you can observe here simple on the head just you give a bun over here so that a knot you can understand differentiate between a man and a woman hope it's very easy for you to draw by using this method you can draw the whirly art using your imagination and creativity you can draw any form of whirly art figures over here now i have considered this one here now let's identify the angles how to know this one it's your observation skills here if you observe here near the hand and the basket here you can find the angle this is less than 90 more than 0 and less than 90 so what kind of angle it is it's an acute angle acute angle you can remember so acute angle more than 0 degrees and less than 90 degrees and the next one towards this hand a bag is there if you observe here this angle like this the hand so this is more than 90 this side also you can observe in the yellow part figure here this side also these angles are obtuse angles means which lies between 90 degrees and 180 degrees you can see here the angle itself it's more isn't it more than 90 and less than 180 degrees now you observe here in the back the corners it's exactly 90 degrees so it's a right angle now here near the neck you can observe here it's a straight angle exactly 180 degrees like that you can draw any scenery greeting card or something or the other which you feel as good and you try to identify the angles in them let's see one more example here we have taken some village people they are celebrating some festival uh, it's like a musical form you can see a drum you can see a trumpet over here it's up to your imagination you can draw it let's find the angles in this if you observe here this angles it's exactly 90 degrees so it's a right angle near the legs if you see here there are obtuse angles that means here all the line between 90 degrees and 180 degrees more than 90 degrees and less than 180 degrees so it's obtuse angle and if you see here the last figure this is an acute angle less than 90 degrees and here the last figure on the top this is a straight angle exactly 180 degrees this is a task for you all i hope you find this to be quite interesting so you can draw a whirly art of your choice think imagine and you can give a festival theme or a sport theme dancing theme music theme consider your own theme birthday party use the whirly art figures and you identify the different angles and name them hope you all like the video like share and subscribe to our channel math bridges fun with math thank you everyone